Hey girl, welcome back to another vlog. So this is Woman Evolve Day 2. They started out really chill. We had breakfast at home and then we drove to the arena. such a blessing. It's a blessing to be in the room, a blessing to experience it all, and I'm definitely praying that God shows up for us tonight. Um, but yeah, the setup is so cute. I spent a pretty penny at the merch shop. I got a book for my husband, two of the Hope is Found books, one for myself and one for my mentor, but I got one of the Hope is Contagious bags with the teacup as well as other merch. So that was a good buy. The bundle I think was $69. Then I also got the Woman of All jersey for my mentor who wanted to be in attendance but she couldn't. So that was a gift for me to her. Oh, I got Pastor Torre's book for my husband and I got a t-shirt for myself as well. Now this video is a true personality video. Like I'm a goofball. the day sessions the girls and I headed out to this taco spot I think it's called Mas Tacos and then we went home for a quick change but just to our PJs for pajama night open heaven. we shall have a grand time up in heaven have a grand time Pajama night was definitely not what I was expecting, but in all of the best ways possible. I was really thinking that, you know, a part of the sessions was gonna be super serious, but actually it was very funny and just very light. And I think that it ended on a, a heavier note, but at the same time, like, I think it was a lot of what we all needed, like a really good laughter with, you know, the different generations, right? We had Mother Jakes, you know, giving her wisdom and being very silly. I think it was really important for all of us, 40,000 women in the room to just be, you know, laughing and happy and just so full of joy. <laughs> Take you to McDonald's. <laughs> you had 
question. I, I did. I go for it. Hurry up. Show. Well, they don't feel as appropriate as because they were building into something, oh. and now you all have dismantled the flow that I was. Because now, what can I say after that? You better you get back on the shit. Um, get, get, on, get on it. So, uh, Children's Church. Um, this is this part of the stage is Children's Church. <laughs> The motherboard is over. This vacation Bible school <laughs> over here. Um, what did you all take away from that that you would like to see as a seed for who you will be in your motherboard era? I'm not doing it correctly, apparently. Um, I gotta do better. You know what I mean? I gotta do better. Um, when I'm 70, I too want Kid in Hills. Um, <laughs> and I, wanna, I still want to have the flexibility and mobility to kick my leg up. Because um, I know there's some things happening over there, Miss Linda. Hey! hey! attributes from, yes, wow, from the motherboard that you would like to make sure becomes a part of your next phase of life? That voice? <laughs> me and you were friends back then. All right. right here. I'll be right here. Uh, Grandma Linda, do you fight? I just want to know because the way you say Or do you whoop? Do you gentle parent? I just chill this church one and she picks Okay, all right. <laughs> I appreciate what we're seeing right here because, you know, when you don't have the right women surrounding you, young, middle-aged, older, sometimes you can become this guy, right? Yeah. And so, coming from a situation... What you want? partnerships. Wow. 
and I've, I've been struggling to get to the next level because I'm just like, I, I, I keep having a higher, like, on the ground level, and I want to get to the next level. And what they said was, don't um, hire from the ground up, hire from the top down. And I said, noted. Yeah. Noted. So that was, that was like an answer for me. real which was really hilarious yeah, yeah. Uh. thank y'all so much for watching 